Oh, here we go. There we go. Yeah, it was cool. Uh, I uh, I didn't play there two years ago. It was Dewan and I think Nick. But um, yeah, it was cool to come back. It's hot, very hot. I think the my mom said the field felt like it was like 110, so it was it was super hot. Um, I would say I would say mediocre, but at the same time, I don't think a lot of people take into account it's the first week. You don't know what they're running. You don't have you have previous film, um, but Matt Guerrero was there, uh, guy who knew Ohio State offense. So um, and they and to scout the forty plus transfers that they had, and basically I don't know how many transfers they had on defense, but I knew it was a lot. Um, to scout those guys too is difficult for an offensive line. Um, yeah, I'd say it was mediocre, but I think we got a lot of stuff to improve on. So. No, I think um, I think we knew what they were going to do. Um, we didn't know that if they were going to implement Matt Gray stuff with Coach Allen stuff, or they were just going to keep it how Coach Allen likes to run uh, his defense. And I, I, they they did a little bit of both, um, but I think it's just building that chemistry. Week one, like uh, Coach Day said, week one to week two um, should be a major major difference. Yeah, yeah. I, I think it, it's more of a communication issue than everything. I mean, going on the road the first week at a, at a Big Ten conference, and don't get me wrong, you, you can call my word for this. I think Indiana is is going to a bowl game this year easily, and I think they're they're gonna they're gonna be a good team, a really good team actually, um, with that defense. Uh, but I think everything was correctable. Um, it's just little slight communication errors um, on on us that we have to fix. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but what, what was it like to, to get a, another start uh, beside him? It's it's cool. I mean, Matt's the old dog in the in the offense line room. Um, it's good to be by him because I know when he's locked in, um, no one's getting around him. <laughs> um, I liked that we were all some – I mean, we were all on the same page. It's just that uh, we had um, a little bit of mistakes. I mean, yeah, I graded out champion, but um, I don't look that as, as oh, look at me. I, like, oh, I'm champion. I'm the – like, no, because you got to keep working. Because um, if, if you stop and you sit on the top of the mountain and you don't keep climbing, then, then somebody's going to get you. Real good, so. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, I mean, it's just, um, and Indiana brings a lot of stuff yeah. with defense, with blitzes, um, yeah. the twist, yeah, their blitz patterns, all that stuff. Um, so, I think it's just slight correctable errors that we made, um, and, and it's more of just getting comfortable with communicating, working the fit, and 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 just executing it. You don't necessarily have to yell anything. The other guy knows. You know what I'm saying? I mean, no, I don't think so because I think if you're always communicating, um, it's always good for an offensive line. I think if you're not communicating, then um, offensive line can be on the uh, different pages, like you said, or different paragraphs, like you said. You missed all the communication a couple times. The fact that Josh Simmons and running back here since you know, July or whatever, yeah. the fact that Carson's a first, you know, second year guy, mm -hmm. I mean, were those factoring into you think what you saw last Saturday? I think it was all of us. I wouldn't pin it on them. Um, I think it's all of us because um, I played a little bit. Matt's played a lot. Donnie's played a lot. Um, I think it's on us and Carson and Josh to to communicate and um, work and know who we're working to. Josh, did that get better throughout the game? And if you think it did, like Jordan Hyland is an example of you all kind of getting on the same page as you all. Yeah, um, I would say probably – Probably late third into the fourth quarter, because um, uh, we knew we had to we had to score and we had to win. Um, and I think that's what people are forgetting is is you're here to win. You're not here to win by. I mean, if you win by fifty, it's good, but a win's a win. Um, 
going against a Big Ten opponent. But I think uh, going back to what your question is, the fourth quarter I think was our time where we were like, okay, now we got it down. Now we know how to they play because you, you don't know how to play. They play because they're transfers. So, like, you don't know how they play together. You don't know. And like I said before, that defense is really good. I'm going to say that Carson yeah. Hinsman called a decent game. Wasn't yeah. Bad start for him. What do you think from him in the middle of that offense? Yeah, I think Carson did really well. Um, like I said, I think all of us have correctable mistakes. Um, but I think Carson um, played a really good first game for his first start. Yeah. I think Coach Day also said in week one, week two, like teams can make a big jump. You've been here a while. Yeah. You've seen this offense do that. What does that look like for this offensive line this week? I think just firing out with low pads and then in the, in the, in the past game, um, blocking our guy and working the fit and knowing who we have. Across the short yard situation, you know, physical problem. Yeah. When you watch that, what did you see? The same stuff you talked about or was it something different? Yeah, I think it was just um, a little bit of miscommunication. Um, I mean, I would say some of that was my fault to Luke. I take ownership of that. He's a new guy. He's a freshman. Um, so I should communicate when we're in um, the personnel that we're in with him. Um, I think it's my fault because I got to tell him, hey, you got this guy to this guy. If this guy comes, you take him. Um, and a matter of four or five seconds. So, um, yeah, I, I, I put that on me. Yeah. Are you guys oblivious to it? Do you take, take it to heart? Do you care about it? What, what's your thought about it? Um, I saw a clip. Uh, Kirk Herbstreet said that uh, Ohio State fans can be psychotic. Um, I, I love Ohio State fans. I love uh, Buckeye fans. Um, but I think – the scrutiny that we're under right now, it, I mean, it doesn't affect us because I, we're trying to we're trying to win. I mean, yeah, the offense line didn't play very well. I, look at around the country, offense line didn't play very well. I, and you can go on Twitter, search up offense line play. I don't think um, they said one good thing about an offensive lineman um, until you win the game, and then like, oh, we won the game, and, and everybody's gonna forget about it in a month, two months now. So. Maybe last time I talked to you, we're like, well, we can do this. Kind of along the, on that same subject, like, we put it on film. We, we put the corrections on film. We know we're, we're good. Now. Yeah. So, what we what you saw then, what you experienced on Saturday, do you think you attribute that more to, I'm assuming, assuming that was not what you guys were putting on film. You attribute that more just to what Indiana was doing? Yeah, I would say, um, I mean, f first game jitters is always a thing, too, I think. Uh, yeah, just going out there. Um, like, like I said, 40 plus transfers. Um, I don't know how many you can get the numbers on defense. I forget how many, but, um, and then seeing how they play and, um, how they make run fits, how they do pass fits. Um, so yeah. Yeah, I think so. I, if, if the hunger's not there, then we're in trouble. So, um, yeah, I think the hunger's there. Um, I think it's just getting on the same page and having communication. What's the puzzle that Youngstown State presents? I mean, uh, you've seen a little bit of video of things. Yeah. Right uh, you know. I think they're really, really good. Really, um, I think uh, they're three or four defensive ends they rotate is really good, and I think their interior is really good. And their line, linebacker play is really good. Um, I, I think we just got to – we got to work to fit and then um, based on there and use our technique um, – and and hopefully one. Josh, thank you very much. Thank you.